Hey guys, how to me here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can recover deleted files on your Android device for free. You will need root, so if you don't know what root is, just search that up and you'll find out what it is in no time. So without any further ado, let's begin this video. Here is um, an application called Undelete. This application is free in the Ender Market. Um, it's called Undelete Beta by Fairbot Mobile, I believe. And this is an application that lets you recover deleted files on your Ender device in your SD card or your or your internal storage. So it's not. It's a really good application. Um, just came out a couple days ago. Currently, this only works for FAT32 users only. It only works for FAT, and um, what you need to do is plug in your USB USB cable to your phone, and then plug it into the computer. And then what you want to do is press yes on OpenSD, and it's gonna plug your phone into. It's gonna transfer the SD card to your computer. And once you have that open, you want to just click open folder to view files. And as you can see, these are all my files that I have on my SD card. So what you want to make sure is that you right click on you right click on it. And then you want to click format. And then all you want to do is click choose the option FAT32. And then you want to click start. And I gotta and I gotta warn you guys that you have to save your, all your files onto your desktop so then you can recover it because once you click start, all your files are going to be deleted. Um, that's how it works guys, I can't really do anything about that. You just have to back up all your files and then you'll be good. And once you have that on your, and once you do that on your Android device, you can unplug the USB cable and you'll be good for the day. It's gonna say preparing SD card, so that's good. For Tegra 2 devices, for like my phone, as you can see, it's a Tegra 2 device. Um, the only, the external SD card works, so the internal storage doesn't really work for mine. And if you open it up, you're going to see um, this menu. And basically what you got here is you could scan for deleted files, and then you could select what storage you want. You could also have this app to be full screen if you decide to have it full screen. You can also, um, if you have any problems, you can write to them and tell them, hey, I have a problem on this thing and it has a bug or whatever. Alright, so what you want to do first is select what kind of storage you want to scan from. Right now, you can choose from SD card, um, internal SD, and it looks pretty sick, so I'm going to choose SD card. Now what I can do is press scan storage, so I can press that. And it's going to scan all the files I deleted. Um, don't expect to find any files that you deleted like two years ago because that's not going to happen. But recent recent files that you deleted like the past month ago or like two months ago, um, you probably will find them. So here are here is all the files I got. You could slide your finger and you'll find all the categories. It has music, images, videos, documents, archives, and packages to choose from. And I'm just going to go into music because I have all these musics I didn't want. So as you can see here, I didn't like this music because it was like not really good. So it says hello, good morning, and and if I go into my music, you're gonna see that I don't have hello, good morning. So let's see, hell, hell breaks loose. That's the only one I have. So I don't have hello, good morning. So now that I don't, now that you guys know I don't have that file, um, I'm gonna tap on it, and then I'm gonna go to, down to the bottom, click restore. It's gonna unmount the SD card and then it's going to mount it again and then it should work and now it says file is restored let's go check out if it worked now here's all my musics and let's see if hello good morning is there as you can see hello good morning is right there now if I tap on it and I open it up let's hear if it works
So you guys can recover more than what you just saw. You can recover videos as well. Um, there's no if you go into the file there, if you go into your SD card and try to find the a file for this application, you're not going to find it because um, they don't really have a specific place for you guys to check. Um, so you probably have to just um, find it on your own. So for example, if you want to restore a picture that you deleted, um, you click restore and then you can go into your gallery and check if that picture is there. For music, your music um, app, video, gallery again, you could go check if it's in the document app or whatever and see if it's there. Archive, right, you could go check your SD card because that's actually going to try to be there. And packages, SD card again. So they're all in different places. There's not one category where they put all the files that you recovered. It's just randomly scattered around. So you have to try to find them. It's not that hard of an app. You can recover actually a lot of stuff, as I told you. And basically, you can also search them from right here from the option right there. It barely came out, so I don't know which phones um, are really good. But the user said that the phones that they basically used to check out how if there was any bugs was the Incredible S, the Nexus S, the Zoom tablet, the Transformer tablet, the Sensation, the Galaxy S 1 and 2, the Galaxy Ace, and the Desire. So those are pretty good phones that you can choose from. Also, I have a G2X, so you could probably work on the G2X as well. So yeah, that's basically that. Go check out Undelete. It's free in the Ender Market. I'll have a link, I'll have a link in the description. Uh, feel free to follow us on Twitter. It's Twitter slash how to But um, thank you guys for subscribing. We have made a thousand five hundred subscribers. So thank you guys. You guys are awesome. And I will be uploading more videos in the future. So yeah, if you guys like this video, rate it a thumbs up. Um, comment if you have a question or anything. Um, tell me what I should improve in or what shouldn't I improve in and tell me how good my video is and blah blah blah. You know what to do. So anyway, kapow!